Hi, welcome to Shipping TV on Monday the 10th of February 2020. I thought I'd just bring you a little bit more up to date with progress of a storm Kira around uh, Felix out to tell you what's happening down here and the honest answer is nothing very much. We still have winds around the range of 25 to 35 knots. Um, around 30 is kind of a reasonable uh, gust I suppose you'd say and uh, maybe getting up to maybe 35 so it's not as bad as it was although the mighty BBC are forecasting gusts of around 50 knots during today um, you're never quite sure to be honest with you uh, just how good the forecast is these days I tend to think they're going a bit on the side of bad news aren't they really because I guess the weather forecasters themselves like to make sure that they're on the safe side <laughs> and uh, don't underestimate things as uh, in the past they have done. What's happening today? Well, nothing very much at all. The only ships that we have moving locally really are ferries. So the DFDS Seaway ships are um, working pretty well normally, I think. And the um, Stena Line ships are also working more or less normally. Uh, they're coming and going as normal. I was quite surprised to see Stena Hollandica heading out yesterday, but off she went. Um, and I hope the passengers aboard didn't have too rough a time. I guess the reality is, as always, when you're at sea, uh, you're a good deal safer than you are when you're closer to the land. So there you go. Um, so we'll see what happens over the next couple of days. As far as ship movements is concerned, as I say, all we've got in the next couple of days really is ferries. There are supposed to be a couple of container ships coming in tomorrow night. We will wait to see because the wind tomorrow is still forecast to be quite strong, although I'm not entirely sure whether it's in or out of Felix those operational parameters for ship to shore cranes. At the moment, all the cranes are up, which is um, well, pretty deadly from the point of view of operations at the port. And as far as the guys who work there are concerned, I guess it's pretty poor news. But uh, we'll see what happens next. There was just one more thing I was going to mention to you, which is quite unusual to see, which is that the wind must also be outside of the working parameters of the dredger James Cook, which is working at the moment in Harwich Harbour. And uh, she's been laying aside, I think it's berth number two at Felix there, yesterday and she's still there today. I don't know when she will be able to resume work, but again, it must be, the winds must be outside her working parameters or her working envelope uh, for doing the kind of work that she is doing. It's quite unusual to see dredges stopping work. So uh, they've got to be seriously concerned about what's going on. Okay, I'm Chris, this is Shipping TV and I will see you soon. <laughs>